Hello again peoples, Bira here from Quarantined Gaming with my next part of my Let's Play for The Walking Dead. Where we left off last time was when we've just exited the farm and on our way to Mekon. So let's jump straight back in and see what's um, what's cracking really. This is as far as we're going. Then it's far enough. I guess we made it there in one piece, I suppose. It's always a bonus. Looks. Look! Survivors. Hey there. You friendly? Trucks run out of gas. Oh, not survivors. Fuck. Oh, here they all come now. We're trapped. Ah! Shit. No. Shot. What's this? Run. The savior. On it. The guy in the out there looks a bit like Glenn. Let's see what's going on there then, I suppose. We can't take risks like this. And we can't just let people die either. When I say that door stays shut no matter what, I fucking mean it. Shit. We don't know who these people are. They could be dangerous. We're not dangerous. Worse, they could have let them right to us. Where the hell is mm. your humanity? They would have died out we there. We have kids. Kids with us. Play the kids card. I see one little girl. What is it? I I have to pee. I'd go out there again in a second. Oh, in, a in a minute. In a minute, Clem. Sort this shit out first. They've got kids, Lily. Those things outside don't right, care. She's got Lily. You should go join him then. You'll have something in common. God damn it, Lily! You have to control these people. Carly and Glenn just ran out there. Ah, see, Glenn, Carly and Glenn. Fight. She's Fuck. not wrong. We're in a war zone. She's not wrong. They took a risk. Yes, we did. And we appreciate it. Now let's settle down. Holy shit. Son of a bitch. One of them is bitten. Oh. Shit. We let one in, you stupid shits. We have to end this now. Over my dead body. Oh. We'll dig one hole. No, I'm cleaning him up. There's no fight. He's fine. Don't you fucking That's people get it? We've already seen I'll find this him happen. Because he got we let grabbed. someone with a bite stay in, and we all end up bitten. Shut up. We gotta throw him out or smash his head in. Kenny, stop him! Hey, what do we do about this guy? Dad, it's just a boy. It, it's Lily, it's I'll handle this. But your heart, Dad. Try re reason with you him if he's not been bit. Down. We reason with him. With the bloody end of an axe handle, maybe. Nobody threatens my boy. Everyone chill the fuck out! Nobody is doing anything. Shut up, Lily. And you, shut the fuck up. They will find He's a bossy bastard. And they will get in here. And none of this will fucking matter. But right now, we're about to be trapped in here with one of those things. What the hell are you talking about? He's bitten! That's how you turn! She just said he's not bitten. He's not bitten. Don't listen, does Please he? stop this. It's upsetting him. Oh, I'm upsetting him. <laughs> upsetting is getting son, eaten alive. It's Larry, right? Man, this is his son. Look around, dumbass. I got a daughter in here. You got a daughter in here. Get your head out of your ass, boy. We've all got people in here. We can figure this out without killing anybody. There's another way. Yeah, with a shovel. Oh, shit. I'm gonna kill him, cat. Just worry about Duck. Lee! Yeah? There's someone in there. It's, it's just late. locked. Keys behind the counter. Probably. Hey, I'm not the bad guy here. I'm just looking out for my daughter. No, you're just the guy arguing for killing a kid. He's covered in muck. She'll find the bite. Watch. She won't. And if she does, the first thing he'll do is sink his teeth into his mom's oh, face. Oh, shit. Then, when she's dead, he'll probably pounce on your little girl. She'll turn fast. Then there'll be three. 
then we deal with it then. But right now, we're just freaking everybody out. Then get ready to deal with it, because that boy it's is bitten. not gonna happen. It is. And we're tossing him out now! Hey, Knock this guy out. Happily. Oh. Jesus! Oh, oh man. Jesus! He fell again. You're a clumsy cat. Tell your worst, clumsiest lead character ever. Just playing that out there. Get away from her, you son of a bitch! Oh, I think it's now. Man, I was lucky. You okay? Just great, thanks. Uh, guys? Oh shit, how's it gonna go in? Everybody down! Stay quiet! They're gonna get in! Shut up! I don't know. Thank God for whatever it is. We almost died because of this bitch and the Richie trigger finger. That was stupid. That was. Uh, uh, Dad! Don't you hurt? What's wrong with him? What's wrong with it? It's his heart. My pills. Um, nitroglycerin pills? Yes. We're out. We've been trying to get into the pharmacy since we got here. Please try to get in there. Behind the counter where the pills are. Guess that's not an objective. Uh, what are we looking for? We need nitroglycerin pills. Please get in there. I'll keep an eye on my dad. Everyone else should get comfy and look for anything useful. We could be in here a while. I'm starting to think this drugstore isn't a permanent solution. You're right. This ain't exactly Fort Knox. What do you suggest? We need as much gas as possible so we can all get out of downtown Macon. Fast. Agreed. Then I'll head out and get gas. There's a motel not too far from here, out towards the end of Peachtree. Yeah, I'll work my way on. towards it and then loop back, siphoning what I can. You know your way around town? You know your way around? Local? Born and raised. If you're gonna do that, here's a walkie-talkie if you get in a tight spot. Hopefully, you won't need it. Cool. Clementine's got the other one. Check in with her and get back here as soon as you can. And you? What's your name? It's Lily. My dad's Larry. Lily and Larry. Keep a good eye on him. These boys will work on getting you your medicine. That's right. And you? You keep an eye on that front door. You're our lookout. It's Doug. You got it. Doug. And I'm Carly. Doug and okay, Carly. Carly. You'll shift in with Doug when he needs it. For now, get some rest. You're a good shot. And I'd like to keep it that way. You got it, boss. Now get Take him those up. pills. Right then. Let's get those pills sorted. See what we can find. Central High Tech State. Papers a week old. Feels like years. Food box. Looks like nobody got a chance to donate anything before this all went down. It's not damaged. And this place didn't get looted. Huh. Chocolate bar. Gotta love some chocolate. Let's uh get it to her. It's not much, but here you go. Thank you. Of course. Hey there. So she's doing. Hi. Any word from Glenn? Nothing. Is he okay? Yeah, I think so. You're doing a good job. Can I uh, get you anything? I'm okay. Maybe I'm a little hungry. Stick. Give you a chocolate pot. Yeah, it wasn't much. I know, Glenn. I'll see if I can find something else for you. We'll sit right. tight. 
Okay. Come back to you and I'll get some more food. I'll speak to these. How's he doing? I'm not sure I got your name. It's Lee. Lily. My dad's Larry. Lee, Lily, and Larry. I was just doing what I had to earlier. Everyone was. Now his heart's acting up again and I'm powerless to do anything. And that violence before with my dad, that didn't help. Mm, you from here? from here? I work at Warner Robins, the Air Force base. Uh, yeah, I know it. Pilot? Nah, just mechanical admin stuff. I deal with a bunch of shitheads and bureaucrats all day. Sometimes a plane, if I'm lucky. You? I work up at UGA. Uh, was anyone was there? anyone here when you guys got here? No, this place was pretty wrecked. We pulled a couple of bodies out of the office. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Did you know anybody here? Yeah, the owners, they were, uh, we were close. I'm sorry. We found an older couple in the office. Dad hauled them out in case they weren't really dead. What's wrong with him? He's What's wrong got a with heart him? condition. He takes nitroglycerin tablets pretty regularly. I've seen a few bad attacks that he couldn't get over and needed to go to the hospital. Yeah, that's uh, not really an option right now. I'm just trying to keep him relaxed. He's got, got a temper. Ah, oh, fuck you. See? Yeah, he doesn't mean it. It's just that... Yeah? We've got kids here. Family. He and I are a family. I'm just saying some people can't handle a temper like that. Hell. Well, he seems like you can. It's just his way. Don't make him the reason everything's screwed. Okay, okay then. Where's her mom? Savannah, I think. Oh, you guys aren't together. Oh, uh, no, I'm not her dad. I found her in a house when getting out of Atlanta. She's been surviving by herself. It's a low kid. I think the girl's Definitely parents a low kid. didn't make it. Oh. I heard an answering message. They were in Savannah. She was home with a sitter. It wasn't good. Well, she's lucky to have you. What do you think about all this? What is there to think? The dead are up, walking around, eating people, and turning them into more... more of them. Yeah, she got pine. I mean, Jesus. That is we exactly what's going on. We need to stick together and get through this. I'm gonna get back to him. Sounds good. We can't let anything happen to Ducky. Oh, no, no, please. Please. Let's get in that office. What's in that door? Where was it? There it is. Let's go through it. That's Kane. He'd zip around Kane, here on the walking time stick. Time. Same kind of thing. Was he sick? Nah, he was okay. I actually saw him whoop shoplifters with it. <laughs> this Kane's protected this place better than any guard dog ever could. Plus, he knew how to make it look cool. Like you and your hand. My dad gave it to me. See, dads are smart like that. Better get this door clear, huh? Can I help? Yeah, you pushed the cab sure. before. Surely you can move the table. Here we go. Watch your fingers in the drawers. Yeah, let's get this out of the way. How are you doing? How are you doing? Yeah, 
It's not that heavy. How about with everything outside? It's not good. No, it's not. But I think it'll be okay. Okay, here we She's go. She's positive. <laughs> I played <it. laughs> Do you have kids? No. You don't have a family? Let's not talk about that. Do they you play, play sports? sports? I play soccer, but I don't really like it. Soccer. I'm soccer. Not crazy about it either. Football. All right, not okay. soccer. Why don't you want to talk about your family? Do they like hate you? Do they hate you? It's complicated. I hope not. It's just complicated. That's all. Why? It just is. But you love them, right? Yeah, of course. Look, my family's gone, and I just wish things would have been different. Bad yeah. Um, got in trouble. I got into some trouble, and, and I didn't talk no to them. No well. This used to be their store. But let's just keep that between you and me, okay? Okay, because of the trouble? Yeah, that's right. No, because of the trouble. I bet they disowned him because he was getting locked up. Ow! Are you okay? I, I still don't know why we were getting locked up. Is it bleeding? A little. I'll find you a bandage. Uh, right, find her a bandage. <clears throat> First aid box. There we go. Get the remote for that thing in here someplace. I'll have a look, have a look for that in a sec. Um, let's get this bandage on. Let's have a look at that finger. How? It hurt. Let's see if we can do something about it. Let's, let's get this cut on it. Up. Yes, please. There we go. Lee? TV set. Yeah. What if my parents come home and I'm not there? I'm gonna say that some of the TV series fans will know that the blood draws them in, so it's a good job Lee? we covered that bit of blood up. They'll They'll find us. Track us down. Don't worry. Keep it being happy. Yeah, okay. We should keep a lookout. I've got my walkie-talkie in case they try that way. Stay close to me until then, okay? No points. I can't tell a little girl our parents ain't going back. See what's in this drawer. Remote. It's the remote to my dad's TV. Try this door. It's locked. locked. Of course we it's need locked. We to track down the keys if we're going to help Larry. From the floor, eh? Oh, photo. Family photo. Happy family. Well, maybe not. Find afraid. anything? Golly. What does she want? Just a picture of whoever was here. I know who you are. Oh, shit. You're Lee Everett. You're a professor at Athens who killed a state senator who was sleeping with your wife. Lisa, this no is your Ryan. parents' store. Folks around town know the owner's son got himself a life sentence, but I'm a reporter for WABE in Atlanta. So I paid murderer. attention to that trial. Maybe you're a murderer, but I don't really care. Frankly, that's a skill that might come in handy. <laughs> to be fair, I'd murder Did you tell anyone out there who you were, out? or that you were tied to this place? That's why it's gonna happen. Uh, What's it to you? To me? I'm not the one with the felony record. You seem like an okay guy, and the last thing we need is drama out there. You've got this little girl to take care of, and... Look, don't make me wrong on this. I don't plan to. Good. 
Because if this lasts longer than a few days, and you're a detriment to the group, then we'd have a problem. I hear you. I'll just keep it to myself. Thanks. Thanks. Don't worry about it. Hmm. So at least I know I'm a murderer now. Let's get back in this room. Wanna head back into the drugstore with me? Okay. Lee? Yeah. You're not this bad, right? I, uh, I apologize for that, guys. That lady said you killed someone. Was that because he was one of the things trying to eat you? Mm, it's, complicated. it's complicated. Sometimes things happen, or you do things and you can't explain them. Let's uh, head back to the others. Just need to get back to Fort Lauderdale. We'll do our damnedest. Let's have a chat with Callie again. Let's have a look at this radio first. What are you messing around with there? A radio. I can't get it to work though. Here, let me have a look. Uh, oh. Hey there. Huh? This is Glenn, and uh, I'm kind of in a jam here. Uh, little girl, if you're there, can you put your dad on the stop. phone or on the talkie or whatever? This Ooh. is Lee. What's up? So I'm down at that motor inn, and well, uh, I'm stuck. Stuck? Yeah, I uh, saw a chance to get some supplies for the group, and a bunch of the Roman ones got the jump on me. I'm hiding over here, but they won't leave. What's up? Glenn's trapped down at the motor inn. Hey, Glenn. We're gonna talk it over and send a group to come get you, all right? <sighs> awesome. I'll sit tight till then. Sounds good. I'm gonna hold on to this until we get Glenn back, okay? I'll take good care of it. What do you think? I think Doug's not great mm -hmm. around zombies. You got your family here. I'll take Carly and her dead eye down to the motor inn, get Glenn, and get back here as fast as I can. If that's what you want to do, somebody's got to. Yeah, I'm in. Good. Doesn't sound too bad there right now. Let me know as soon as you want to head out. I could use a jog. Yeah. Let's uh let's get straight on it then I suppose. Go this way. Yeah, there she is. You're a pretty good shot. Well, you don't fuck with a reporter, especially one that's three days out from her last cup of coffee. Bad point. Ready to, you ready to head out? You got it. You? Yeah. Yeah. Let's go. Right then, I'll call that there. So we met some new characters there. Six new new characters. Made our group a little bit bigger. Um, they were resting up in my parents' drugstore. And now we're off to save Glenn who went on a supply run. So I'll check back for the next part of this, see if we can save Glenn and get back to get some drugs for Larry's hat. Also check out some of the other videos on quarantine from the other guys, I'm sure you'll find something everyone will like. Give us some comments in the bottom if you think you would have took a different route than I've done. Um, give us a like, subscribe to the channel and check out what we've got coming soon guys. Speak to y'all later, bye.